Can't you believe how much they're making us pack for the school trip? So it's right here. A new unique outfit for every single day of the whole semester. Really? It's 120 pairs of shoes, 120 pairs of pants, 120 shirts, and to top it all, 120 ties. Manny, where's all your gear? It's right here. That can't possibly be enough for 120 unique outfits. You're in trouble. Of course that's enough for 120 unique outfits. What did you pack in there? Four pairs of shoes, three pairs of pants, five shirts, and two ties. That's all for the whole semester? You are really in trouble. Guys, we're going to have to pay extra money for every suitcase. I'm going to go carry on and I'm going to save myself the extra money. Anyways, how do you think we're going to fit all of these into the trunk? No. Well... Uh, good question. I know! Why don't we all just call in sick and forget about school? I guess that's not an option. Guys, use your head. Making unique outfits requires different combinations. I think he's on to something here. I still don't get it. I've seen this done in math class before. Combinations! If you haven't noticed, I still don't get it. Open up your suitcase, Manny, and let's see how this can work. There are four pairs of shoes, three pairs of pants, five shirts, and two ties. I know! Manny can make four plus three plus five plus two combinations. So that's enough clothes for... 14 days! 14 days isn't enough for the whole semester, Manny. No, no, no. This is enough for the whole semester. You need to multiply the articles of clothing to get the combinations. Watch. For every pair of shoes, I can pick one of three pairs of pants to wear. That makes three plus three plus three plus three combinations, which is the same as three times four or 12 unique combinations of shoes and pants. 12 is even less than 14. That's not even close to for the whole semester. But then we multiply by the number of shirts. Because for every shirt we pack, we can make a unique outfit. With each of the 12 combinations of shoes and pants. Now I don't get it. Watch. Every time I add in a new set of options, like five shirts, the combinations are multiplied by five because every shirt can then be lined up with every other combination we have found so far. So now we multiply five by 12 to get 60 outfits? Yes, and we double that because for every tie we have, we can double the combinations because we can attach a tie to each outfit. So that gives us 120 unique outfits, enough for the whole semester. With only 14 articles of clothing. I get it. I get it! Oh no, we're gonna miss our plane. We, we have, have to repack! repack.